to Cute Anime Figures TV. I'm your host, Craig, and today we're taking a look at Monster High Ghoul Spirit. So these are the Ghoul Spirit Monster High dolls, and today we're looking at Venus Mike Flytrap, which you can probably see. There's Venus. So let's take a closer look at Venus and all of her accessories in today's video review. So here we are with Monster High, and today we're taking a look at the Ghoul Spirit series, and they are made by Mattel in 2013. So as you can probably see, we have Venus McFly Trap, which is the uh, very first Ghoul Spirit doll that I picked up, and uh, you can probably see the packaging is a little bit similar to the Scutament Roller Maze dolls in that same similar packaging. And as you can see, we've got the Monster High logo up here. We've got some Monster High stuff there. Got the logo there, the Skullet. We've got a uh, megaphone there with the Monster High emblem on it. We've got Venus McFly Trap's name there. And a very beautiful photo of her. In her outfit and stuff. Show you the side of the packaging. Got the Monster High logo there. You can see the accessories there in the window box packaging. Show you underneath all the other stuff. And at the side, we've got Monster High here, and we've got that same web in design as usual. Also, we've got some more things here. No. Anything that looks like it can be hung on, on the wall or whatever. So let's have a look at the back of the packaging. On the back it tells you a little bit about Venus. So as you can see, it's got Monster High there. It says Venus Flytrap. says Daughter of the Plant Monster. And also in here we've got a nice photo of all of the Monster High dolls that you can get in this wave. We've got Frankenstein, Slow Mo, Venus McFly Trap, and Spectre there. So, uh, and it says School Spirit. And it says here, What Monster High Prep Rally? When? 12. Where? Jim. Says, why come show your ghoul spirit? That just says it in many different languages here. You can also visit monsterhigh.com as well. And we've got a uh, Mattel logo there. And more Monster High logos and stuff. Uh, the Scullet for Venus. And, that. and it looks like she's got a H there. That. So these are kind of like a Pret Rally dolls but on their own. So uh, I'm going to open it up and take a look at her. Now I know some of these Monster High dolls, um, some of them do come with display stands and stuff like that and I've heard that some of them don't. So we're going to open up Venus and take a look at her and stuff. So by the way it's the fir my first time having a look at Venus. She is the very first one I have of her. Let's actually open it up. Not. Can actually. Not. Okay. This is something different to uh, the other ones. They do come out very, very easily. And so there's nope, no display stand, unfortunately. It's a bit sad though, no stand with these ones. 
And that is Venus in the card back there. Got the megaphone there. No hairbrush as well, that's one thing. There are got all the other things there going on back there. So essentially open her up in that. First off I'm going to uh, do with the shoes and stuff. So some of these are very, very uh, easy to get out. And I'm just going to see if I can get that. What's this here? one of those uh, things. See if we can actually get to this uh, accessory. There we go, that's that. A uh, blue megaphone. Got the Scullet logo embedded in there. Yeah, these are the same similar ones that you've seen with the uh, exclusive set. Nothing uh, different, just the same ones. And uh, let's see if we can get these here. I'm just going to take out those tab things. Somewhere. So here's Venus, as you can probably see. Can I move her head? She's got these really nice earrings, very nice. These like vines around her. No. In fact, Venus actually does stand up. As you can probably see, it actually does stand up really well. Looks like they come out really easy. So, it's okay, uh, hair is really nice and soft. You can probably see that the bangs there are just being cut off. And obviously, she's got like short hair there. It's kind of fuzzy and furry there. Like shaved on one side and then long hair on the other. Take a look at the. 
So yeah, come in there. Yeah, look, good look at the makeup. Very cool indeed. Love that. See the teeth there, kind of like a Venus, you know, like a um, fly trap, so fangs there in the mouth. Very nice. Love the earrings, if you can actually see them. Very nice indeed, and the like vines. Uh, love the outfit. Got a very very nice cute outfit on. Okay, got that same vine design. And there, got the Monster High emblem as well. And that very cool. Yeah, you can actually put her hands on her hip there. Stuff articulation just the same as the other Monster High dolls. And that same. Okay, good look at these shoes, very nice indeed, You've got some studs on there and that. They like chains and studs and goodness me, those shoes. They're actually flat underneath there so they can actually stand up. And there you go. Got the articulation there as usual. You can actually take these shoes off if you wish to. Got like a slip there, slip there. The outfit is removable, by the way. Yeah. Very, very nicely detailed. Indeed. Love the little vine things going on. That. Okay, good look at the skirt stuff, the details. Show you the back. Now she doesn't come with a stand, like I said. That some ones high dolls come with stands and some don't. Um, I really wish that they did, because it will help her to stand up. And obviously she can stand. Oh, she can. Uh, in a very cool pose, and she can actually stand up. And, um, she comes with this, like a megaphone. I don't know why, but by the looks of it, she has that in the other hand. So the megaphone can go into her hand, I suppose. In this one. Yeah, can actually put it in this one. Put our fingers together, I suppose. So it looks like she's a uh, It looks like she's about to use it. Or not. Kind of wants to uh, fly down there, and her hair kind of wants to go all crazy. Could probably fix that with. Uh, Actual uh, hair combs. I don't actually have one on there to use. I wish I did. So that's her accessory. Um, nothing else. See if I can try and get that in there. If it will stay, there we go. 
So now she's holding that. She can hold it in whatever pose she wants. Hold it upwards, but it's on a little side of taking it over, I suppose. Oh, kind of wants to go like that. And the vines kind of want to go down or whatever. So, yeah. Let's see if she'll stand if I turn this on. Obviously, uh, I get a cool pose that shall stand. No, no, she's not going to do that. So, just have to do this manually. doesn't want to uh, stand. So that's what she looks like at the back of her hair and uh, stuff. And then that's what she looks like at the front. No. She looks pretty cool. Stuff. This is really weighted when it's actually on her hand. So, yes, she can hold it, but it's a bit too heavy for her. Um, obviously, you can't hold them that good. Oops, I keep slipping out. Slip down there. See, this is what happens when you don't have stands. The uh, monster high dolls kind of want to do whatever they want, and plus, uh, no hair combs. Stand. There we go. So I kind of have it down her side. Like that. And you could have her arm upwards. That's what I like that. So yeah, let's go to my final thoughts for... Uh, I don't think I is that bad, but anyway. Let's kind of zoom up here. Little shoes. Very beautiful indeed. The outfit itself. See her makeup in there. Her hairstyle, very cool. Indeed. Very nice. Just zoom out there. So yeah, this is the first one that I've got that doesn't come with a stand. Um Well, let's go to my final thoughts for uh, Venus.
Okay, so final thoughts for Venus McFly Trap. Um, she's a very beautiful, uh, very cute most high doll. Uh, she comes with a accessory of a uh, megaphone, same similar ones that they used with the uh, three pack, which you get to lie Persephone and Meow Lodi. Um, so yeah, I can't really say much about Venus, other than uh, she doesn't come with a stand, and uh, that's probably going to be the downfall of the Cool Spirit series um, for this line. I think a few of the other Monster High lines do probably not have stands, I'm not quite sure, but uh, the Cool Spirit ones so far, as far as I know, don't come with any stands, and I think it's Headmistress Bloodgood that doesn't come with a stand as well. Uh, it'll be nice to see them with every Monster Idol, there should be some stands, uh, I would like to see that. But overall, she's not bad, she can actually stand up, um, since she's got the flat shoes and that, but really, I think it's best that she should be on a stand and that's what keeps pretty much all of the other Monster High dolls uh, standing up properly instead of them falling over and that because I know some of the accessories do tend to drag their arms down because it's like weighted same with the megaphone there I, I was trying to get the megaphone to do the same thing as uh, it is on the front packaging there for, Vinia, for Venus. Um, but overall, her outfit is really cool. Um, she's just perfect. The articulation's still there. Um, the only thing I can say is no stand. That, that's just <laughs> it, all I can say. Uh, but don't be put off by that. I know sometimes it could put people off uh, from buying the Ghost Spirit series. And uh, I don't know if any of the other most high doll lines have that or not, you know, without stands. But hopefully we could take a look at some more. But anyway, uh, yeah, that's it. Venus McFly Trap. Can't say much about her. Um, obviously, the articulation is still there, still looking great. Uh, the hair looks perfect, straight out of the packaging. I know sometimes it can be really uh, all over the place, but it's not too bad. Not far from I can see now. Uh, but yeah, just for this line, that what's going to put people off is no display stands and. I think having a Monster High display stand is essential for any Monster High doll, um, for, especially for those that are collecting them. And uh, so, yeah, if you haven't got Venus, definitely pick Venus up in any of the Monster High series. And that's so, uh, this is the only Venus uh, variant I have. Or variation of her. Um, at least we've got her herself, so we can add to our collection. Definitely highly recommend picking her up. The articulation is just perfect. Love the outfit and everything. The accessories are uh, minimum. You only get one accessory, and that's just about it, which is the megaphone. And yeah, you can probably display these with, along with the uh, three pack. A fear leading dolls that I have. But anyway, until then, take care, everybody. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Hopefully, I can look at some of the other ones that may have display stands and some might not, because I know some of them do. Um, but just for Venus, and I think Slow Mo, Frankie, and Spectra in this series, they don't come with stands neither. Um, unless you do, I, I'm not quite sure about that, but, well, since Venus doesn't, but, 
viewers might, I don't know, still can't get over no display stand, but, uh, she actually stands up pretty well on her own, obviously. And that, uh, I think that just about does it for this review. So today we're looking at Monster High, Gold Spirit, Venus, McFly Trap. And, uh, yeah, definitely add this one to your collection, and if you have any spare display stands, um, use them for the Equal Spirit series, if you've got any spare ones. And that, and, uh, yeah. So, until then, take care, I'll see you guys very, very soon. Until then. So here's a quick display video showcasing Venus on display. Obviously, she'll stand up even though she doesn't have a stand, but she kind of stands up pretty well since she has those flat, cool looking uh, shoes she's wearing at the moment. So, yeah, until then, take care, everybody, and I'll see you guys very soon. If you've got any more questions or comments about Monster High, please leave me, let me know in the comments below. Tell me what you think of. Uh, the Ghoul Spirit series and some of the others. And you can always check out all the other Monster High reviews on Cute Anime Figures TV on YouTube. We still have plenty of reviews to come, and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Until then, see you guys very soon. So, uh, yeah, have a great day, everybody. So, here we are with. Venus McFly Trap from the Monster High Ghoul Spirit series. As you can probably see, she's standing up on her own uh, without a Monster High display stand, but I kind of prefer them to have the stands really. See the other three here Rochelle, Goyle, Dracula, Claude Wolf, they all have stands. And same with the rest of the Monster High dolls that I have. Um, definitely do recommend picking her up, but the only downfall to the series is they don't come in stands. So, but yeah, until then, I'll see you guys very soon. And until then, take care. Cute anime.